thanks for joining us for another Whitfield's Food Review. Today we are trying the infamous, it's kind of infamous, I don't know, every time anyone hears about it, it sounds kind of freaking weird. I guess it's kind of like Taco Bell's version of KFC's Double Down, remember that? Sick of that pesky bread. Here you go. Here's two pieces of fried chickens. This is the Taco Bell Naked Chicken Chalupa. I gotta be honest, I'm very confused by the fact that they call it naked chicken because this is breaded chicken. Is there meat in there? Or is the meat the chicken? You know what I mean? Yeah, I guess you're right. I didn't think about that. The shell is also the meat. I guess that would be weird to put meat and beef in there, but still, it's not naked though. Been like talked about and fabled for years. The elders have passed down this legend and now it is finally here. It doesn't really have a fried chicken smell. Uh, it, it reminds me of the color, it's like very orangey and it reminds me basically of like um, the Cheetos. So now because of her braces situation, this is gonna be very difficult for her to eat. Um, we're gonna go ahead and break you off a little piece of this chalupa bar. There you go. That's the inside. I don't know if you can see that. Just pound it out, flatten, <laughs> processed chicken. Interesting. Is it, what the fuck is that? Is that mayonnaise in there? It just smells like a chicken sandwich. Does. You want to taste like? It's like a chicken sandwich. Yeah. There's a, okay, the very, the, the okay. There's a, okay, the very, the, the okay. It's, it's surprisingly soft. I thought it was gonna be hard as a rock when I first saw it. It's not. The chicken is very soft. It actually works. It just tastes like a boneless chicken sandwich. The very end, you do get a hint of that Mexican Taco Bell seasoning. You get a little bit of, little, little spice that gives it kind of a taco-y flavor. Spicy chicken sandwich. I'm gonna have to look it up, but I swear to God, my palate tells me that that's mayonnaise. I don't know if it's because it just tastes like every chicken salad I, sandwich I've ever had, but my brain's telling me that's mayonnaise and that's lettuce and that's chicken and that's cheese. Therefore, this is a chicken sandwich. I mean, this was $2.99. <sighs> I think it's a little expensive because I don't know if you saw the size of it. I don't know if you saw the size of it. Not the largest thing, not the largest thing, but I guess you get a good portion of the protein when there's that much and essentially the entire shell is that. I think it's fun to try. It is tasty. To us, it just tastes like Taco Bell's version of a chicken sandwich. Yeah, if you had Taco Bell, you want Taco Bell. Right. We just had that, the sweet tangy one that just came out the double stack and a lot of people were like, I want to go Taco Bell. I don't want that flavor from there. That's just not what I want. I think people are going to try it. I don't think it's going to be hugely successful. Do you? Probably not. I think, yeah. Yeah. What you said. There you what go. You Three out of five. That's a solid score. It's not a great score. It's not an absolute home run. I would personally not get this again. Not because it was so bad. I just, when I go Taco Bell, exactly what she said earlier, when I go Taco Bell, I don't want a rolled up chicken sandwich. And that's exactly what this tastes like. So if the idea of a rolled up chicken sandwich served to you at Taco Bell sounds good, this is exactly the item for you. Drawback of this is gonna be, there are gonna be times that this has been sitting around a little too long or is a little overcooked and that's essentially your shell and you're gonna be like, <laughs> like a dog with a you know, piece of leather. It's not gonna work. It's definitely a novelty. I don't know, but that's what we think. Let us know what you think. Are you gonna try this? I bet you probably will because it's too weird not to and I agree, that's why we have to do it too. So let us know what you think when you do try this or did we persuade you, did we dissuade you? I don't know. Let us know in the comments below. We always love hearing from you. Thank you all so much for the well wishes for her mother. We really, really appreciate that. It was very nice of you guys and we do appreciate that and we will keep you updated on all the news when it happens. So thank you again. Please hit that notification button, that way you'll know when we put up more videos because YouTube likes to let you not know. Even though that makes no sense what I just said. Don't worry about that, don't think too hard about it. Just like, favorite, subscribe, hit the notification, tell your friends, and until next time.